exercise, fitness, movement. Either you love it or maybe not so much. I'm Coach Suzanne Patrick, certified TLS coach and trainer, certified group fitness instructor. And I do like working out, but I will be honest and say that I don't feel like it every day. So let's talk about those days where you don't feel like having more energy, toning up or reducing stress. I'm just kidding. Those are the things that exercise gives us. So let's change our mindset. Let's focus on the things that we do want from exercise. And we do want instant gratification, don't we? And so then instant gratification through movement or physical activity is the uh, blood flow to the brain. It is the boost in the feel-good hormones. It is the, the blood flow in the gut. And so uh, you'll feel better that way. Maybe you feel lighter or slimmer and more energetic after your exercise. So I want to shift our mindset and think about the benefits. I used to think years ago I'd be jogging on the treadmill and, and feel my fat jiggle and I felt like I had to do more. I feel like it wasn't working fast enough or I would be sitting in my sweatpants thinking I'm comfy, I'll work out Monday or I feel fat, I'll start next Monday. Or maybe you've had, uh, you can relate with having one too many cookies or one too many chips and you'll start next Monday. But we want to take care of ourselves. We want to love ourselves and, and speak to ourselves that way. And your mind is surrounded by two ears. And whatever you think is what you're going to hear loud and clear, be it positive or negative. So let's change our mindset. I know for coaching with TLS for about 10 years now that a lot of people focus on weight loss, which is fine, but let's focus on fat loss, right? And let's focus on building muscle. Muscle dictates your metabolism, gives you energy, holds up your skeletal structure so that you can enjoy the things in life that you like to do. Let's focus, uh, shift our focus from I have to to I want to, or uh, maybe you don't want to quite yet, but you know the benefits from that, and so you can sneak that in just as you do your vegetables maybe with children you know, right? You have to get it in somehow. Let's focus from weight loss to wellness. I know that wellness is a byproduct, weight, weight loss is a byproduct of being well, and so uh, exercising is going to get you feeling better, which is going to help you continue down your journey instead of feeling discouraged and not wanting to work out because it's not working. It is working, but we need to be consistent with that. Today I did my workout. I did a cardio. I did a high intensity interval training, which is a form of cardio. There's cardio, there's strength training, and there's uh, stretching. And I was in my second of my third round of exercise. I was sweating and I thought to myself for a brief second, okay, I think I'm done. But the exercise, the workout wasn't done. And so I was the only one that knew. Uh, I was the only one that knew uh, that I was going to finish the workout or not, uh, how I was going to feel, right? I had to make an instant decision and a choice to commit to myself and to take care of myself because I wasn't willing to do another workout for the day. So I had that split thought of not wanting to finish, but I finished. Why? Because I love myself and I care about myself and I know it's bringing me wellness. You might need an accountability partner for your exercise program or your workout routines. You know, that could be somebody at home. That could be somebody states over where you say, look, I've scheduled five days a week for my workouts or three days a week for my workouts, or I'm going to do this type. I'm going to go bike riding or I'm going to do Zumba or, you know, whatever you're going to do. Let somebody know so that you can check in with them. That holds you accountable first, but then they're going to be loving and they're going to follow up with you and see what you've done. You might find somebody that you um, idle on YouTube, right? Different videos, um, different forms of cardio are the HIT exercise. You can sprint and jog. You could do Zumba. Strength training is lifting weights at the gym. You could use bands. You could use your own body to push against or pull up. And uh, ideas for stretching could be Pilates, uh, yoga, bar, those types of things. And so find something that works for you. Exercise should be fun and exercise should be enjoyable for you. Maybe you need to try something different. There's different ways that you can fit that in your day. Um, think about being consistent too with your workout. I use a calendar, as I mentioned. I put smiley faces on my calendar when I work out only to be positive about that. I can look and say, yay me, I did my five days or I met my goal. Or I can say, mm, I only did one day this week, but why is the question. It's never that I did one day. The question is why. And if it was because I was stressed or busy or maybe I didn't feel like it, okay, that's where I need to make my adjustment and make it work for myself the following week or the following month. I like to 
assess monthly as well. So be consistent with whatever you're doing, just like you are with brushing your teeth. You brush your teeth every day because you're preventing buildup, you're preventing decay. And then you see the dentist to really give a thorough look twice a, twice a year. Would you ever only visit the dentist twice a year? That would be gross. You brush your teeth every day, just like you should exercise. You should move your mass every day. It could be a walk. It doesn't have to be intense, right? You have to do something. But here's the thing. When you're consistent with your workouts, just like you are with your teeth, you're going to create wellness for yourself. Now, if you miss one day of workout, let's, would, if you miss one day of brushing your teeth, that would be weird. But would anything happen? Nothing would happen. You'd be okay. And you're going to go back to your routine of brushing your teeth every day. Same thing with exercise. You want to exercise often or frequently or be consistent with that. And if you mess up or miss out one day, that's okay. Nothing's going to happen. So find what works for you. Find an accountability partner. Talk this out with someone. Explore new options of exercise and be consistent. Go find something for yourself. Mark it down. Take some action. And let's find your fit with TLS and exercise.